All right, so this is a small example of how does it look like to make a game with no engine. So I'm making this game for Ludon Dairy, uh, a game jam that is happening this weekend. And I'm adjusting the animations and everything. But this game, you have this X here and you'll be able to like uh, unequip or equip, or equip this X uh, during the gameplay to do other stuff. But the thing is, Cave Engine did not have uh, do not have support to parent an object into a bone before. So you can see this is an Excel, this is a different object, this is a separate object here. Um, and there's also another Excel in his back, in her back, sorry. But this was not possible in Cave. So what I did, and this is interesting, like this is the fun of making games with no engine. I closed the engine, I opened like Visual Studio and I started writing some code. And now I quickly uh, wrote this animation socket here. So now I can create, like I can parent this object to the armature itself. But then with the animation socket, I can select a bone for the rig and copy the position, the rotation, or the scale if I want, and do the adjustments if uh, as needed. And with that, now I can do this. So new feature implemented in Cave, very easy, and now I can proceed to the game and make this work, of course. By the way, another thing, uh, taking advantage, oops, a warning here, it's not severe, um, is that I can also, for example, in the equip animation, you can see this, uh, what I would do, is I will go ahead here in the callbacks and I will create a frame callback for this um, for this animation and I'll, I'll, I'm not gonna create right now because I believe it's not gonna work but and in this frame callback in the specific frame that it touches this I can write Python script to toggle the visibility of this. And this is something that I actually implemented uh, because I needed something like that for the animations. So yeah, this is a quick update and a quick showcase on how does it look like to make a game with no engine again, because this, this topic is quite important, honestly. And I believe we need to talk more about it. So let me go back to developing this game because I'm late already.